Why are you speaking to me? Go away, Jesus, we don't want you here. Why don't you get that? I was shocked when I heard these words flying at me. I was in a new town, a new city, thinking I was getting a fresh start, but all it was the same old behavior that I'd experienced in my previous school. I had no idea bullying was really an actual serious thing. The way someone can make you feel about yourself by using simple, scarring words is unbelievable. Did you know that teen suicide rates have grown more than 50% over the last three decades? It is estimated that 160,000 children miss school every day due to their fears of being attacked or intimidated by other students. I once watched Mean Girls, the movie, but at the time I had no idea that it was based on something that I would end up feeling. I began feeling so low about myself and was becoming seriously depressed. Hate, pure hate from my classmates. It was hard to believe. I would sit in the bathroom stalls at lunchtime so that nobody would see me eating alone. Eventually I had to beg my mom to pull me out of school so that I wouldn't feel so worthless every day with no friends. The way these heartless people made me feel. Because of this experience, I made it through one of the most hardest and lowest times in my life. Bullying at any age is a crime, but it's particularly hard when you're a teen. One of the mantras that has gotten me through this trying time was, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. That quote was written by a German philosopher, Friedrich Nietzsche. I know that I wouldn't be the person I am today if it weren't for the stress that I went through. And on a positive note, I've started a nonprofit organization where kids from my new school get together to give back to those in need. And I found comfort in writing and I'm working on getting my book published so that I can hopefully inspire other people my age. Through all these trying times, I have to say that I couldn't be more proud of what I've become. I find that I can use my sadness because if you're being bullied, it's time to take a stand and do what you have to do. Tell yourself that you're awesome and nobody can change who you are. And trust me, what goes around comes around. This is my story.